lost tape obtained by ABC News from Romney's 2002 campaign for governor, surreptitiously shot by his Democratic opponents. I'm a big believer in getting money where the money is. And the money is in Washington. I've learned from my Olympic experience that if you have people that really understand how Washington works and have personal associations there, you can get money to help build economic development opportunities. Just two weeks ago, Romney suggested that under his leadership, the 2002 Salt Lake City Olympics got no more taxpayer money than previous games. In the history of the Olympic movement, the federal government has always provided the transportation and security. So we came to the federal government asking for help on transportation and security. But in this video, he talks about getting all kinds of money. We actually um, uh, received over $410 million from the federal government for the Olympic Games. That is a huge increase over anything ever done before. We did that by going after every agency of government. He even boasts about getting money for the Olympics from the Department of Education. That's right, the Department of Education. I believe the number was over a million dollars of Department of Education funding to buy tickets for kids. This, this way, we got kids there. We also got additional revenues that we wouldn't have had. That kind of creativity I want to bring to everything we do. It's exactly the kind of approach he promised to bring to Massachusetts in 2002. I want to go after every, every grant, every project, every uh, department. You might expect a candidate for governor to promise to get federal money for his state. But that is precisely what now presidential candidate Romney has attacked his Republican opponents for doing. Republicans spent too much money, borrowed too much money, earmarked too much, and Rick Santorum and Newt Gingrich have to be held accountable in this race. I'm the only guy that hasn't spent time in Washington.